Welcome back to the shop. Well, I'm not endorsed by Vaporust. Um, I'm not a paid channel by any means. I'm a very small channel. But I figure I'd give you an up to an honest uh, view of just how good this stuff is. This is a five gallon pail I just built online from Northern Tools here in the USA. It was quite reasonable for five gallons. It's $69 plus um, tax. And I'm going to be using it a lot on my channel to clean up rust from different things I don't want to necessarily polish. So I have a couple of things I'm going to put in there. And this is basically going to be a mini review so we can just see how good this stuff is. Enjoy. I don't know why, but I'm actually quite excited to see how well this stuff works. I've seen so many videos online of this miracle stuff. It's very interesting to see. Open their honest reviews. I guess we're gonna find out. Okay, first things first. There is a bunch of this stuff in here, so there probably is right at five gallons. What I don't like to see is the the pail that some you see some people are using. Apparently, it's not included in the five gallon bucket. I did see you could get it in the three gallon bucket, um, but a trip to the dollar store. For an old colander or something like that will be more than good enough. I'm not that bothered about it. I'd rather have the extra two gallons of rust remover than to worry too much about that. Until I get a chance to go to the dollar store to buy a colander or whatever, I'm going to use this fishing net, this old fishing net. Let's see what sort of rust eating fish that we can find in this bucket. Here's the hatchet hammer combo in one of my Lanua videos. And also the anvil, whatever it is, something to do with the cobblers. We'll stick that in there too. Hopefully the the net will hold this. I don't know if it will or not, it's kind of heavy. We'd be fishing for rust fish. Actually, it's not too bad because I got where well, the net sits, so I can just put the lid back on again. So now the wait begins. Next time you see this, I'll be fishing it out and it'll be nice and clean, hopefully. Okay, so this has been soaking for 24 hours, or oh, overnight, you know. And I guess this is the big reveal to see just how good this vapor stuff has done. Really is quite impressive, even just by looking at it like this. really is quite insane by the look of it. Right, let's get you a bit closer so you can actually see. Well I have to admit I really wasn't expecting it to be quite as good as this. Um, this is, as you see, I just now pulled it out and just wiping the stuff, just wiping the stuff off. 
there is literally there is no rust that is very very impressive I mean, it almost looks like the effect you get. It actually smells. It smells like the rust converter stuff that you can put on. That might be the iron oxide being taken off and the smell that's left from that. But as you can see, I mean, this stuff looks like I've. It's, it's mad. Now, to my untrained eye, it looks to me like. Can you see this? It looks like this is the hardened part. And you see a line across here where it's been tempered or hardened, heat treated, and they left it soft in the middle. Tell me what you think in the um, in the comments. It certainly looks like it to me. And let's have a look at this anvil thing too. I mean, these these really look like the you know the videos you see of the fake channels where they fake rust everything, and then you have the miraculous transformation. To me, this is almost as dramatic as those. I mean, look at that. And that's just literally the rust remover and then a dry cloth. So yeah, I'm very impressed, very, very impressed. I like it when something exceeds my expectations. That's always a good thing. I don't know if you saw that, but there was some residue for some tape on there. That came off straight away too. So all in all, super impressed. I'm glad to see that this is just as good as I thought it was gonna be. It's no small investment. Um, the, you know, the, the larger amounts you buy, like I got the five gallons, it was $69 plus tax. So all in out of the door, it was like $74, $75, something like that. Now that is a cheap price for this, but well worth it, I think, for the five gallons. You buy a gallon, it's like 20 to $25, something like that for a gallon. Or you can go out the three gallon pail, which is actually about the same price as the five gallon but you get the little plastic um, colander thing to, to put your materials on and I would suggest doing what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and go to the dollar store get something plastic with some holes in it that I could just dip in and out or I might just keep my fish in there, who knows I'd rather have the extra two gallons of rust remover to be quite honest especially on this channel where primarily that's what I do is take rust off things so but anyway, definitely worth the buy. I would certainly recommend it 100%. And I'd just like to remind you too that I am not affiliate, affiliated to Evaporust whatsoever. This is purchased out of my own money. And, uh, and that's that. Very, very good stuff. And you'll be seeing me use it a lot more on my channel. Okay guys, that's it for today. Um, let me go take some allergy medicine. Because like I said, allergies are starting to hit this time of year. But other than that, have a good day and look out for my next video. And don't forget to subscribe, like and hit that notification bell. Because i got so many more things coming up. Including this gigantic hammer that I've already mentioned. That is, as you can see, I've got pretty big hands and it's a beast. Alright, speak to you later guys. Bye.